let's stick to Patek or go to Patek. And then we're starting with the most complicated watch in my collection. So it's not only a world time or contemporary perpetual, but it's a perpetual calendar, it is. But then with a split second chronograph, Please. the Radha Ponte 5004 made in platinum with a black dial, pretty impressive piece. They made, uh, I think they started in 1996 and they discontinued in 2012, but they only made like 12 a year. It has a Le Mania et Bosch and it's not really made to house, let's say, the Rad Gapante complication. Mm -hmm. So it was a technical marvel that Patek was able to pull it off, but it took quite some time. This is so nice. So, so if somebody likes this watch, what's the entry level price point of these nowadays? Uh, 5004 in yellow gold are the least valuable. It starts at quarter million approximately. Yeah. But I would also definitely suggest you check out the 3970 first. So that is the watch that got me into the perpetual calendars with chronograph function. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of bang for your buck. You can pick those.